ีบอกเลี้ยงเคทุกทุกทุเรียนเอาทูดูเรียลไทม์ล็อกยูซิงดัตต้าเบสเพื่อสวีเอ็ดฟอลเดอร์เรียนชุดดัตต้าเบสFirst, we need to set up the MySQL server. Type localhost. Create a new database. Okay, we create a new database. Tutorial database. Click on create. Click the tutorial database, and then we start to create the table for tutorial database. Now I'm using a three colon. Give a name, date, time. Date and time. The second one, TV number one, TV two. This one we want to monitor the two set of TK4S, and we click uh, save. After you creating this uh, database and table for database, go to uh, you can open our DAQ master. You now we go to support devices. Uh, for this application, I use uh, two set of TK4S. That we can start scan unit address. Okay, now two set of my TK4S already detect. 
stop scan and then we click OK after that uh, I will take a present value 40k number 1 and then present value 40k number 2 after that uh, we start create the database using uh, the AQ master for this function only uh, the AQ master pro is uh, supported so you need to buy our the AQ master dongle so we can uh, see here uh, the save is database uh, you can see you can uh, save in database or csv file now i'm using database to save the the pv and then you give a one name to this uh, log name and then condition here uh, for this uh, tutorial i will show you any condition so we will uh, save save interval is a uh, one second and then after that you go to database connection info click here and then uh, this is a database that support for our DAQ master pro okay now for this application i using my sql Server is a local host. And then the username is a root. And password, no password. Okay. Uh, tutorial. Okay, sorry, I'm not. I forget. I forgot the what I just create just now. So we check back um, to drill DB. This is a database. So, okay. One more time. Okay, database. Uh, please uh, check this login. Okay. After that, click here. We MISQL local host. Username is a root database is the tutorial to tutorial DB. After that, you click next and then table temperature real time log. Okay, next and date and time database time field setting and then next after that uh, you must uh, click here double click so we choose the tag for PV okay double click here PV number one then double click for PV number two click OK and then OK after that, we click OK. Okay, we go to uh, the AQ space. You can drag all the value here. After that, we start run. Run. Okay. We go back to our database here.
okay now we connect then the real time block is active now okay the pv value number one is uh, 37.3 and pv value number two is 24 so we can check our database now fresh Sorry, because I'm still not start to run. Okay, when we run, so the the login will start automatically. So now uh, the value already here. Can refresh. Refresh. 